When Governor Hochul presented her state budget, buried in the back of the 200-page document was a sentence about reuniting the College of Nanoscale Science and Engineering with SUNY Albany, separating that school from SUNY Poly and Marcy. The College of Nanoscale Science is seen as an economic driver for the Capital District, and political leaders from Governor Hochul to U.S. Senator Charles Schumer have touted the Albany operation as an important part of a plan to make New York a major player in nanotechnology and microprocessing nationally. But what would that mean for SUNY Poly and Marcy, and for the nanotechnology projects going on there and in the future? Eyewitness News reached out to the interim SUNY Chancellor and Governor Hochul's office to get an understanding of what this all means. The Chancellor's office said that they will talk with us when the plan is developed by the Governor, and we have not heard back from the Governor's office. Assemblywoman Marianne Buttonshawn and Oneida County Executive Anthony Pacenti did speak with Eyewitness News. Here's what they had to say. The first thing we need to do is to take a look at what is going to happen. There is nothing in the budget this year uh, regarding what she reflected in her statements. However, uh, I continue to work with individuals in regards to the importance of what will happen and what could happen. I am in Albany every week and I am in uh, the governor's staff's office reminding them of the importance of what we need to do to ensure that our best college that we see on the SUNY system right here in Marcy, New York, needs to remain strong and vital. I guess on one hand, you know, I'm, I'm glad it's a proposal and not a, something that's, that's, that's complete, but nonetheless, it is something that needs to be corrected and, and I'll be blunt and say scrapped, you know, uh, sooner than later. It, the economic development impact is immense, you know, and, and then, you know, coupled with, you know, what does that do to the enrollment and the overall attendance and, and, and overall interest in, in SUNY Poly, which, you know, the, the, the boost that, that nanoscale science gave that campus several years ago has paid off. We're not asking for anything new here. We're just asking you to keep in place what has been working and what is working. Senator Schumer's office responded to Eyewitness News saying the senator explained that the Marcy Nano Center remains an important piece of the picture. The state is presenting to Washington in order to get money allocated for development through President Biden's economic proposal. Earlier this week, Schumer hosted officials from Washington to a roundtable discussion about the Mohawk Valley's capabilities and the role it can play in the chip industry and in drone research. Schumer promoted the Marcy Nanosite as a shovel-ready location adjacent to the Wolf Speed operation. He also cited the area's location and access to major transportation outlets and resources like water and power.